Hey everyone, Angel's Planet back for part, what is this, 21? Of my Let's Play of Franbo. Woo! Excited! Alright, what the shit were we doing? I have no idea. It's been a while. I've been freaking slacking. Wait. Didn't we? I'm having a confusion. Didn't we do this? We totally did this. Okay, uh, I had to redo all of the opening shit, but it's done now, and now we have the thing for the ECOG clock, again. Yay, look at us go. Woo. And I accidentally, I think I must wake up Makupa. Yeah, we know. And I accidentally opened this door, but nothing really happened other than this. Yeah! So we got some doors to explore. Yeah, that looks like her eye, so I guess since we're in 101, we could try 102. Right on down. Hello, is anyone living here? Poke myself in the eye. What a big eye, what are you looking at? Me? Mm -hmm. 103? Door 103, ew, it's all bloody. 104? Hello, door 104, open please. There's a key. A, a key, friend. Oh, a key to unlock things that are locked. Wow. That's so astute of you, man. We got the two keys now. Okay, and 105. Door 105, it's locked, of course. Well, you didn't know it until you tried it. Little grumpy kins. Let's use the key here. No, let's, let's use the key here. Okay, I'm just going to try both these keys until I find one that works. So. That's the wrong key. This is some Alice in Wonderland shit. Ah, there we go. We have a key. Okay, that was a key. How about this key? What is this key unlock? Okay, so we have 104, which looks like a roof, and 105 that looks like stairs. So, let's go on the roof first, because we're naughty children. I guess. I don't know. Oh! Who are you supposed to be? Hi there. How are you? Intruder, infiltrator, why would you enter without presenting yourself? I am Ok- I love how your- your iris is talking there. I am Okula, the eye from beyond. Behold my beauty. Oh, I'm sorry, what a big eye you are. You must see very well. I see everything, nothing less. Um... Everything, can you see my cat? Your cat, how is it possible that you own a cat? Are you a royal, queen, princess? All the above, baby. Oh, we are friends. No, I don't know own him, but we have a relationship. We are friends. Friends, how lovely. But yes, I did see a cat earlier today. It was crying for help from inside the cage. Yep, that sounds like my cat. The bearer of the cage enters Mabuka's underground. He's still down there, inside the cage. Can you describe the cat you see? Big yellow eyes, pink nose, its fur is very dark. Black, it's the deepest night. It's him! It's my friend, Mr. Midnight! I have to go and find him. But Mabuka is asleep. Waking her up can end in disgrace. I'm not afraid of her. Me neither. Well, feel free to take anything you need from my home. Well, isn't that generous? You are brave, and I respect bravery very much. Thank you, Okula. I'm Fran, by the way. I'll see you around. Can I just have him? I'm sure he would come in handy on this journey. Um, what's this? What is that? What a snail. A golden snail! Another one. Another one. And what's this? A hairbrush. Ah, a hairbrush to brush hair. Fantastic. Great observation. The eyes are looking around. I wonder what they see if they don't have a brain. Ah, huh, this mirror is transparent. Fantastic. That's useful. And what about anything else? I, ho I hope you find your cat friend soon. I still see him inside that cage. Well, what does that do? Bloop. It does absolutely nothing. Oh, it turned on and off the lights. Okay, what's that do? Do, 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 do. What does that do? Oh. Sh should we should we poke it? We should poke it. Okay. Oh. Oh my. Well, okay, we've got the, um, the corpse in the bathtub with the soap, a rose, a whale, 
bottom, whatever. Okay, one thing at a time. What is this? What? Oh, poke, poke, enter button. It says enter button. I'm brush out a button. Ha <laughs> ha! Hello, happy monkey. Paper squirrels just like it's in this here stuff. It seems it won't budge. Maybe I have to give it a coin or something. How about a button, like it says? And glowy tree. What am I gonna do? Unplug it. I may need this wire in the near future. Okay. And what the hell? Is it? We can't. We can't do anything with any of this over here. Oh, we can do something with that. Take that. The bottle is perfect. I'll take it. Fantastic. Those must be parts for our clock. We can't do anything with. Okay, I'm kind of glad we can't do anything with that because it's telling you. It's giving me the willies. <clears throat> Alright, I think we're done here. Let's go back and in the next door. 105. Yes, 105. Can we not? Can we? Thank you. It's an odd way to enter a door, friend. What do we got here? We got eyeballs. Oh, mysterious paintings in a mysterious place. This, that is indeed very mysterious. Oh, dead skulls on the wall. Hello, Mr. Skull. You have a little flesh left on you. I don't think that's appropriate, miss. I'm sorry, but I need this key. There are many doors that I wish to unlock. Tell your friend to be nice and open his mouth. He won't. He never does. Besides, his teeth are reinforced. It would be hard to get that key without his permission. Reinforced teeth? I see. I'll see what I can do to take the key yet, then. You can ask. And who are you, if I may ask? I'm Fran. Well, I'm Fran. Nice to meet you, Fran. I'm Roberto. Welcome to Mabuka's Den. Oh, shit. Can we get out of here? Mabuka? Who is Mabuka? We've not been talking about Mabuka this whole time. At least I think we have. You don't know who Mabuka is. You don't. Leave now. Just leave. But Roberto, sir, I haven't been here before. Don't, don't judge me for not knowing. Tell me who Mabuka is instead so I know. Okay, okay. Mabuka is the mother of darkness. The darkest darkness, the obscurity, the end of light. Mabuka is the mother of all creatures from the fifth reality. What? Am I at the fifth reality? I thought Ramor was the king there. Ah, uh, Ramor, the terrible black, the son of darkness. Nobody likes him too much. You should go now. I have said enough. All right. I'll be back later anyway. I must get your friend's key. Okay. Fantastic. <clears throat> Let's, uh, poke this guy's pocket. Inside the little house reads a note. We already got a key inside the little house. Because we're, we're vamped like that. So, thank you for that. Shh, child. Oh, we have, uh, what, what's the phone number? Is it two, zero, four, eight, six, three? You get bonus cookies if you can tell me what that number's from. And the hat? It was forgot his hat, or maybe that hat forgot its head. Okay, I like the design choices here. Is this his worst clothing? But where is he then? Oh, that is Edward's jacket, isn't it? Oh, alright. Oh, you're not it, word, are you? Can I just can I have this this rose right down here on the on the ground? Apparently, I can't. Hi. You good in your bath? I'm not done, mother. Shh. I need a better voice for him. I need a better voice. Um. I'm not done, mother. I'll take another bath after this one because I stink. Who told you that you stink? The creeps that walk on my skin, they are getting sick. They vomit every time they eat from my skin because I stink. Okay. I don't smell anything. What's this smell we're talking about? I stink like the most unpleasant stench. I believe you, but I can't smell it. Sorry, I have to go now. Bye. I'm sorry you think you stink. Picture of a whale. Oh, a painting of a whale. Very nice. Okay. Um, can I have your soap? Does the sound of my heart disturb you? 
it can stop all of a sudden, and that would be the end. I just want the soap, dude. I don't like thinking about my heart's beat. I just want the soap. Soap? Are you having trouble with hygiene? Terrible. Lots of... Yes. Yes, terrible problems with hygiene. I smell like my flesh was all rotten inside. But that sounds delicious. I don't think that would be a problem. Okay. Maybe for you. Just let me have the soap for a little while. All right, then. Take it. It's all yours. Can we not touch him, like, at all? Thanks. Why are we even touching the soap he touched? But be careful with the hijackers. They love children that smell like soap. Okay. They eat their baby bodies and keep the heads the beautiful baby faces. That sounds terrible. I'll be careful. Thank you for the soap. I'll see you later. Yeah, let's let's just pretend this never happened and never talk about it again. Even Fran's freaked out. Like, let's let's go. Let's go, man. Let's go. Um, what do we have to do with you? We have to figure out something to get your mouth open. Soap. Wait, does soap have anything to do with this list? A bulb, a clock, a bottle with water, a soap bar, one glove, black wire, and piano keys. Where do we need a? Where do we get water from? That guy's bathtub? I really hope not. We better check since we're here. I don't really want to stick my hand in his bathtub, though. Like, seriously. Can we not? Can we? No, that's not what I, that's not what I wanted. No, 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 yes, you was in, in the, in, in the, there, the water. This would work wonderfully if the water was on. Okay. Smarty pants. Fill the bottle with water. La, 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 fantastic. Yeah, turn, turn that off. Alright, let's go. So there's one more thing. Checked off our good old Listeroni here. Yes, now we need a wake-up clock, a working bulb, one glove. And one glove. Hee <laughs> hee! Alright. Now what must we do with this guy? Can we, like, stab him? Shh. Use bloody knife with skull. I won't even try that. Well, where's your creativity? How about the soap? Some soap in your mouth. Yeah. Picky, picky, picky. Um... I don't know. What else do we have to do? Uh, we need a button. We need a button to do the thing. We need something to open that guy's mouth. So. I guess I will see if I can't find a button. Oh! It has a big button. Look at that. Cut that button off of there, baby. Got ourselves a button. Big pink button from my summer dress. Fantastic! Can we leave now? Woo! Look at me figuring out things. Or did we already do that in the other video and I just forgot about it? I probably forgot about it, cause I'm a useless piece of crap like that. Alright, back in here. Alright, so let's use that good old button on the, the barrel organ. Oh, picky, picky, picky. Alright. And there goes my button. Now what? Now we turn the crank. Uh. Get out of here. I'm cold. Yes, okay. Picky, picky, picky. Okay. Pliers. Cool. Okay. Did we need that cord? Yes, we did. We'll take the cord and shut up the monkey. Yes. Let's leave. It's still musicking. It's still doing it. Oh, a working bulb! Oh, I need to turn it off first. Turn it off. Uh, working bulb. Yes. Yes. Good. Now all we need is a glove, right? A clock and a glove. Wait, don't I already have the glove? No, I'm retarded. Okay. Fantastic. Why is that music still going? I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm, ta I'm thinking we take the use of pliers for this guy's teeth. It seems really brutal. 
Ouch! Ouch! Bio's sitting over there with headphones in, and occasionally I show her the screen. And she said she was not looking at that. Take that. Thanks, I think. Shiny little key, come here. I wonder what door you unlock. Can I keep the pliers though? Like. How could you? I hope somebody takes off your teeth as well. Well, the tooth fairy already took all of my baby teeth. Insane, isn't it? Well, that was interesting. Do we have any clues for uh, that phone now? No. If you guys have any ideas about that phone, let me know. Okay. That, that monkey thing, man. Okay, 103. Nope, wrong key, wrong key, 102. There we go, 102. Oh, hello. Oh, I see her glove. I see her glove. First, let's talk to the kitty cat here. Oh, what's that? I've just got nothing to say to the cat. Wow, what a big kitty cat. Can I have this? Wake up, clock. Perfect. You look exactly like Mr. Midnight. Okay, what's in there? The back of the giant cat. Okay, can I... Thank you, that works. Perfect. And I need to get over here. How do I get over there? Can I pull this? Oh! Very helpful, Mr. Kitty. Thank you. That's very nice. I got the glove. Hee <laughs> hee! I think I got everything. Um, alright, so... We have to build the echo clock on the back of the giant cat. So here we are. What is this for? What is... Where are we going? Could I not have done that? I'm afraid. Oh! Oh! Hi! How are you? Excuse me, I really need the key hanging just behind you. Eh, I need a voice. Um, excuse me, but I do not talk to strangers. You don't need to talk, just let me take the key. If I choose not talking to strangers, but not listening is also part of the deal. How disappointing, I have a question, are you stuck to this tree? I am firmly attached to it, why do you ask? I'm just curious. See you later. Can we brush her? Can we brush her out? Look, I found a magical hair comb. Isn't that great? I don't know. A hair comb? What is that? Well, it's to make your hair very pretty and smooth. Would you like to try it? I don't know. Is it dangerous? Okay. Oh. I have to choose an answer. It can be very pleasant if you do it smoothly. All right, let's try it. All right, but just promise you won't burn me, okay? It'll only burn if I'm in danger. Be gentle and nothing bad will happen. Okay, I'll be gentle. Kind of weird. That's yeah, so creepy. So creepy! It worked! Oh, I turned the firefly. It flooded away. What is happening to me? I've never experienced anything like this before. Could I give her a nicer voice? But how? You are a Lucifer, and all Luciferns I've met do this all the time. Really? Well, thank you very much. It feels incredible. I feel like I need to fly away. Now she's free. Yay. I have that. It must be for the key door to door for 103. I can smell it. Can I? But I can't reach it from here. What to do? I think we need to go build our clock first, honestly. I don't know... My grabomatic night would be nice here, but I don't have it anymore. Um, yeah, I don't have anything. Unless I can, like, lasso it. No. I would try lassoing it. Just saying. Let's go back down. The kitty cat's watching me. Kind of weird. Get over here. Okay, so... Wow, what a big cat. You look exactly like Mr. Midnight. Okay, why are we... Okay. Alright, I think it's time for us to build the clock. Because it says, let's build the Echo clock on the back of the giant cat. It says, let's see, let's read it all. 
Muckaba, Muckaba, wake up, Mother Muckaba. The horn child is playing with the light. The vocals are angry and shining too bright. Mother Mokaba, wake up, wake up, and give up the child before the darkness ends in the hands of the light. Mokaba must wake up. Let's build the ekog. What does ekog mean? It's G O K E. Goke? I think maybe it was something backwards, but I don't know. Ekog clock on the back of the giant cat. Too strong are the bubbles and too bright the light, she cried. Me, Mabuka, the mother of darkness, will open my heart. Please take my little horned evil child and shut down the lights. What? What? Sure. Sure. Whatever. Whatever. Okay. So, we are out of time, though, for this video. So we will definitely have to make the Ekog clock in the next one. But, uh, yeah. This has been an interesting, uh, journey. So, thanks for watching. This has been Angel's Calamity playing Franbo Part 21. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Bye, I'll say bye. Louder. Bye. She loves everybody, too.